Yo guys, welcome to the channel. My name is John and you guys watching Tech Talk. So if you guys watch my videos before on this channel, I uh, made a couple of videos about Microsoft Flight Simulator in the past. And I think Microsoft Flight Simulator is one of the best VR games available right now. But for you to really enjoy Microsoft Flight Simulator, guys, uh, sometimes you have to spend some money. You got to get the right graphic cards and things like this. And most people will recommend that you spend some money on the fly stick or some water pedal maybe so today i'm gonna share my opinions on this i've been using uh, my fly stick i use the xbox controller to play the game and i can share my opinion on both whether you should buy a fly stick or is your xbox controller enough to really give you that experience that you're looking for in microsoft fly simulator so if you're interested in this topic today guys stay tuned i'll be right back welcome back to the channel guys thank you for supporting this channel if this is your first time here you are watching tech talk this is a channel uh, where i share my personal opinion with you on tech every week so today i'm going to share my personal opinion with you on whether you should invest on the fly stick or keep using your xbox controller for microsoft fly simulator regular one or the vr version so the first thing an experience Microsoft Fly Simulator Gamer will tell you is to buy a fly stick and some water pedal maybe if you got the money to do that. The gaming experience is more realistic using a fly stick and a water pedal combined because uh, a fly stick looks so much cooler when you play in the game. It gives you that feeling of being a pilot sometimes. Okay? But there are so many different fly stick out there. Uh, they can go from super expensive to extremely cheap. But you usually get what you pay for in terms of quality. The more expensive ones give you more functions, more button to play with when you're in the sim. I bought myself a Thrustmaster Airbus, uh, which is a modified version of the Thrustmaster T16000, a very well known affordable fly stick. You guys know Thrustmaster makes some good fly stick for average consumers, and they're usually pretty affordable, but there are some expensive ones uh, also. So, like I said, the Thrustmaster Airbus is a modified version of the T16000, but it's not expensive at all. The Thrustmaster Airbus is made of a plastic material but it feels very premium i don't personally like the color but it is okay i also bought some new water pedal as i mentioned earlier guys uh, the water pedals are plastic also same brand from thrustmasters and uh, they well built also guys okay and like i said it's not expensive they're very affordable so I spent hours of flying in Microsoft Fly Simulator using the fly stick and the water pedal since the game came out. Um, I spent hours and hours of playing it that way. Sometimes uh, things work and sometimes the experience is very, very frustrating using the Thrustmaster using the fly stick and the water pedal. Mapping the button can be hard. I think it makes the game feel worse using the fly stick and the water pedals and things like that than just using xbox controller so a few weeks ago after the xbox update came out i decided to play the game with my xbox controller and honestly guys i was extremely shocked the game plays so much better it's so much smoother controlling your plane flying in vr using an xbox controller it's very more stable it's easier to get to the menu button. The game works so much better for casual gamers using an Xbox controller than using an expensive fly stick. So now I have to be honest, the immersion is not the same. You know, that sense of being there doesn't feel the same using 
the Xbox controller. The fly stick make it more realistic, make the experience more realistic than using an Xbox controller. So if you are a new Microsoft Fly Simulator gamer, if you're just trying to enjoy the view and trying to relax flying from city to city in the same, the Xbox controller is definitely the way to go guys. It makes it so much easier to get in the game, get out of the game, change menu, you know, all this other stuff so much easier using the Xbox controller. Here's my final advice to you. If you are new to Microsoft Fly Simulator, before you plan to spend your money on an expensive fly stick, try to use your Xbox controller first, see how it feels. To me, I think it's much more better than using my fly stick right now. So that was my personal opinion, guys. Whether you agree or disagree with my opinions, guys, I truly appreciate you for stopping by watching this video and supporting me so take care of yourself and i'll see you guys soon for my next video guys thanks for watching